Today is the last home league game of the 22-23 season for Bracknell Town as we take on Gosport Borough in our latest league game, which is very important. But Gemma, um, in a, no, yeah, another important league game today. What are your thoughts going into this one? Yeah, no, it should be an interesting, crucial game for us today. Um, seeing as we last time we played these guys was back in November and we won 4 0, so it should be interesting today. And it's a lovely day, the sun's out, so what, yeah, the, what, what more can we ask for? Yeah, the first thing I was going to say is wow, the weather is glorious today. Um, yesterday the, the conditions were pretty bad here, from what I understand. Um, but today the sun's out, it's game on, thankfully. We are near the finish line for the league campaign, and wow, it is ever so close in the race for the league title which we didn't expect only a few months ago um, but look going into this game Bracknell we come in from a very successful uh, Easter weekend uh, all three games won uh, we beat Beaconsfield to win the Supermarine and Met Police that is the wrong way around but there you go um, but yeah we are in great form still going to this game we conceded all the last three games but as long as we keep scoring that's all that matters because we need those wins so the title for Bracknell um, I'm not expecting it. I expect um, Western Supermare to probably win it. It's, it's in their hands now. Um, but I do expect us to try and go for it. Um, technically, we could win it on Thursday away at Met Police if we beat Gosport today and we beat Tro City away on Monday night at Plymouth Parkway's ground. Or it could even go down to the last day of the season at Plymouth Parkway next Saturday. Um, Gosport Barilla visitors line 17th position. Um, I think it's been a disappointing season for them. They were in the National League South not so long ago for quite a few years. Um, that's after they climbed up for the non-league pyramid. Um, they've just about technically survived relegation, I think, now. So I think a point today would definitely guarantee that for them. But I'm sure they're safe from relegation. And um, But they've had a change of management since we last played them. So it's second versus 17th today. Gemma, what is your score prediction? I'm going with a 3-0 win to us. Uh, I'm fairly confident in this one, and like I said, hopefully we can win it. Yeah, and do you know what? I'm going to agree with you. I'm going to say 3-0 as well. Um, Gosper Borough beat Hartley Whitney last time out, 1-0, um, who have pretty much gone down. Um, we're waiting today's results. Um, but I expect us to do, get the job done today and hopefully finally get a clean sheet. Um, but yeah, we're looking forward to this one. We hope you are too. Um, it's all getting exciting now, but let's get going inside the SB Stadium. We lead 1-0 at the break for a Daryl Sanders late penalty. Um, Gemma, I think it's fair to say we have been the better side overall. 
Yeah, definitely the better side. We could have had one go up in a couple of minutes of the game, but it just was unlucky there. But um, I think more goals in the second half, definitely. Yeah, definitely. And I'd say Gosport's defending has been pretty good, to be fair. They've been getting five at the back a few times. And they've been blocking shots and everything like that very well, so fair play to them. But we've got to, have a much, we've got to get a few more goals in the second half, like you said. Um, West Super are drawing, so at the moment they're dropping points, which is valuable for, to us. But um, another big second half needed. Come on, you Robins. Some people just straight leaning. Go on. He takes take us to the, the Football League, league. Danny! Danny! He gets the ball, he takes the fist, sure she doesn't miss. Danny Bailey's crackle goal machine. La 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 So a 3-1 win, um, fair to say I think we're both happy with that result. Gary Abrasogan's late strike that sealed the win was absolutely fantastic. But Gemma, first of all, your thoughts on um, what was a rather frustrating second half, I'd say, at times. But overall, again, we got the job done, didn't we? Yeah, we got it done, which we needed to do. But um, second half at the start was very sloppy. Um, they actually looked the better team more than what we did. But uh, <coughs> we got together, made some subs, and obviously they did magic again. And... Also, Gary's last goal was, was brilliant there. Yeah, Jack Dean with the second goal, uh, simple tapping, I think it was. Um, and that was very early on in the second half. Um, but yeah, I think overall, mixed bag of second half. But overall, again, we got the job done. And that is the main thing heading into Monday's big league game away at Tro City. And then uh, met Police well on Thursday. So a quick look at today's other league games. Some of the games... Um, could still be playing right now. So I'm just going to quick glance through the ones that matter the most. 
Um, North Lee 3-3 three, three so far at Beaconsfield Town. That's a, a six goal thriller there. Chesham United uh, with a 3 1 win at the moment against Salisbury. Hotley Whitney's relegation is confirmed with a 2 1 defeat at home to Tiverton. Paul Town finish 1 0 against Harrow Borough to cement their place in the playoffs still. Pro City 2 Met Police 0, not the result we wanted. And, and another result we didn't want today is Western Supermare 1 Merthyr Town 0. So, because the games are still ongoing at this moment, I believe, um, we're not going to show league table just in case but we presume Western Supermail will be at the top of the table Bratnell still in second so um so yeah we're still in a good position to potentially win the league I wouldn't say good position actually I'll say it's still it's a title chase yeah it's still a title chase like I say Truro away on Monday and then Met Police around Thursday the title could, could go down to the wire um, wet Met Police all the way to Plymouth Parkway next Saturday but if you've enjoyed this video please hit like down below it helps the channel massively and your support is always greatly appreciated and um, yeah hit, feel free to hit the subscribe button it costs you absolutely nothing to can watch these non-league vlogs um, we'll be back I don't know when we'll be back um, I might go to Met Police on Thursday I probably will actually might be late for that one might not be quite as a good video video as normal but either way I'll hopefully be there and um, we might even be at Plymouth Parkway away next Saturday so we'll wait and see on that one anyway but until then thank you for watching and we'll see you next, next time, time.